Hello there guys, how are you doing today? Hopefully you're having a great, great time. So today is just a bit more of the MSQ. We're currently having the mission on Rest in Ishgard. And I hope uh, we can actually get a long way into today's MSQ grind. No, actually so far it's been great. I, I, I love having ward. And I can't wait to see what is up next. So let's go. I mean, hopefully my reading today isn't as horrible as it should be. Why do I have to go all the way over there? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, we had the heretics um, breaching the walls of Ishgard. And they did it very, very easily. Which I find absolutely strange. Now we already know that they were somewhat aided by the Holy See, so he is trying to get more power, and we'll just see what happens. That was rather too close for comfort, but it would seem that, um, but it would seem that calm is returning to the streets. My mind, however, yet clamors with a thousand questions. You returned to Ishgard in the oddest of company, my friend. Through that, we uh, we do have a certain witch. How does this look? Okay, that's not bad. But I'm sure... Do I want to get it? It's 139 though. Is it really that useful? Should we just take the money? We just take... We'll, we'll just take the money. There's too, too much to get. Or, uh, Orthodox Mayhem. I can't wait actually to do some achievement hunting. I posted an event on the Discord that um, should facilitate that. And just going map for map, there's some faiths um, that are difficult to do by yourself, or actually somewhat impossible. Maybe, maybe when I'm having like end gear, end game gear, like level 90, and I scale down, it would actually be enough because it does actually help. Ah, uh, then my friends, uh, we already. Okay, so he's actually saying somewhat the same. That, my friends, was too close for comfort. Praise alone that things did not end in bloodshed. I confess, I was more than a little dismayed to see you in the company of Lady Iceheart. Whatever is going on, Daily? Well, it's been a tale, man. It has been a tale. Beg your pardon? You traveled to the Churching Mist together? Hey, hello there. How are you doing? Alone with Assistin. Yeah, Assistin has actually been like... No one is talking about how red his armor has become, actually. Like, killing Nithok. How long have you been playing Final Fantasy? Never was there a more unlikely alliance. Nor one so magnificently effective. Nithok dead, the heretics, pacified. Father and the Ensa Emric must know of this. Let us break the news to them together. I will bring Sir Emric to Fort Tom's Manor. Wow, we just just casually a dragon, dragon on the um, the guy who's in charge of the entire thing. Yeah, like, oh, just 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 come to my house, mate. It's not even his house. Oh, what you say? Yes, an excellent suggestion. I am at the crossroad currently. I have to find content of Final Fantasy XIV. You know, already at ninety for all. The Damn, man, that's <laughs> holy shit! You've been playing a lot, dude. I um, I don't have. I think my highest level is like sixty-one or two, and that is a uh, a gatherer. <laughs> you go. All combat class is ninety. I, I'm like every time I enter a dungeon, I'm like, oh shit! Hopefully, I don't fuck up. Steam says 900. Yeah, I was actually hoping I could get the game on Steam as well. Um, but the the linking of service accounts was just a nightmare. And I was like, yeah. Is there, a, is there a way, like a chat command, where I can see how much time I've been playing on this character? Like, that you know of. I'm sure there was something like that. I'm sure someone is like, oh yeah, no, I want to hit those fans. Oh, you are brilliant. 
uh, blade. Well, it is absolutely very possible that I have turned off system notifications. Let's put it into battle. Because I never, never look at that. System messages. Wait. Apparently no. Alright, so it doesn't exist. Playtime. Ah, we have played for 11 days, 6 hours and 4 minutes. Only, only 11 days? Holy, damn. That's not much. <laughs> That's not much, dude. Oh, man. Yeah, barely 300 hours. Barely. And I'm a slow-ass player like uh so when i started playing uh it was on another character and i skipped through mainly like a realm reborn and i felt so bloody bad about it when i and when i finished heaven's wood like only like the main quest like we've done the whole dragon war song thing like i i know for the next 30 missions what will go what be will be going on but I felt bad because I was like, they're referring to events that kind of happen like in a Realm Reborn or like past Realm Reborn, like in between, uh, like version uh, 2.1, 3, 4, uh, whatever. And I was like, what's going on? So I restarted the game and so far I've been reading everything. And I'm dyslectic, so you can imagine how slow I'm, I'm reading. Uh, wait, I think I can actually go through this. Put it back on social. Oh, wait, we're actually over here. Cool. So, yeah, I'm, I'm quite new to the game. Um, I'm always struggling with some of the rotations. I don't use potions in my rotations that just verifies to basically everyone I'm a big ass noob but I'm having fun you know and I think that's the most important thing let's go over here let's go to the to Z mana so yeah if you if you're if you're like ooh man ah potion's not that important thank god like every rotation I looked up it's like well, you need to cast these two skills, then hit like a, a mind potion, and then you do this rotation, and then you do that again, and then 60 seconds are up, or 5 minutes, and then you hit that potion again, I'm like, oh, that's... I need to get some crafters, holy shit, man, I'm not buying all of those potions, no way. Let's get in here. Uh, uh, so these guys sometimes talk funny, that makes me talk even worse. Praise Halone, you are safe. Thank God it's voiced. My safety was never in doubt, Father. For I had the Azure Dragoon and the Warrior of Light by my side. You weren't even there, mate. What are you talking about? We bring the most wonderful tidings. Oh, he is so he is so damn jolly, I love it. The infamous Lady Iceheart, here in Ishgard? This is most unexpected. You would have actually expected them to, like, arrest her and just ride a burner at the stake or something. She has done much to quell the violence. The Inquisition may not approve, but we are glad of her presence. And with the Great Worm's demise, even our nation's more reactionary elements will have scant grounds to press for her immediate impeachment. Definitely. My thoughts exactly. 
What of the truth revealed to us by Hreisvelga? That the origins of the Dragonsong War, a core tenet of Vishgardian faith, are quite unlike those depicted in the scriptures. That men and dragons once lived together in harmony, and that it was man's treachery which shattered the peace and plunged our peoples into war. That sounds very man-like, yeah, that's true. We were very, very profound at making war, so yeah. Makes sense. The same scripture also describes the origins of the High Houses. Were it exposed as false, the legitimacy of our rule will be called into question. Hmm. I'm seeing something which I don't like. Give me a quick second to see what's up. If I had this problem before, and I kind of don't want it to go weird again. Oh yeah, I've actually put that a bit down. So yeah, you, sometimes you might hear some background noise. I was thinking like it was a bit too rough. So yeah. Okay, never mind. And there's nothing going on. Thank God. I've had moments where just my mic just stopped. And I'm very, very anxious about that. If both highborn and lowborn can trace their ancestry to Thorden and his knights twelve. But a single sip of dragon's blood is required to confirm their lineage. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, this is amazing. Like they're all they're absolutely fucked. They're they're absolutely like, oh my god, like if they're that dragon blood from what I gather around it, like it's a bit of a curse thing. Everyone will eventually like turn into this Dravanian because of that. I think I get it like that. I'm not sure if it's true, but I, I think it, that is what's going on. And uh, like confirming it, like, but a single sip of dragon's blood is required to confirm the languages. And they're all, they're all. If the Holy See knew of this and chose to remain silent, their crimes are grievous indeed. Regardless, this state of affairs cannot be allowed to continue. Sir Emmerich, you cannot mean to raise this matter with the Archbishop. I don't think they will respond well to I that, consider no. consider what you are proposing. If the Holy See chose to conceal the truth for centuries, what reason would they have to reveal it now? Yeah, nothing. At best, you will be branded a heretic in Clapton Irons. Yeah, because they will never, they will never step down. Like it, it's a power struggle. The, 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 the Holy See is, is, is the most influential and powerful person in Ishgard. He's not going to say, yeah, okay, yeah, it's our fault. Yeah, we did this. Yeah, you know, yeah, everything we've told you so far has been a lie. Uh, can I still be a leader? I don't think so. Then at least the Archbishop will have shown his true colors. My friends, this war will never truly be at an end until the truth is made known. You must see what lies on the horizon if it is not. When ruled by fear of a common enemy, we were united. Man, I love this guy as well, man. He's so cool. But now we have none. During the war, the highborn needed men to lead and the lowborn men to follow. Not anymore. Tis but a matter of time before the old order is called into question. Lady Iceheart will share the truth with her followers, and the Holy See will be powerless to stop its spread. The disenfranchised will rise up united, and blood will flow in the streets once more. A divided Ishgard will not survive. Tread carefully, Lord Commander. My lady, is it wise to let him go? <laughs> no, of course I not. I sympathize with the Lord Commander's desire for reform, but to approach the Archbishop in this manner bespeaks an idealism to which I did not think Sir Emmerich prone. 
Though he comports himself as a realist, he has long dreamt of reform. It was that idealism which first drew me to him. That which made me swear an oath to serve. We must not think of ways to hinder his cause, but rather ways to aid it. Even should the Holy See cry heresy. I don't trust this guy. You cannot mean. If the Lord Commander does not return from the vault at the appointed hour, I mean to go and fetch him. Fine, sure. Have care, my lady. Your words border on treason. Should they reach the wrong ears, you will be declared an enemy of Ishgard. That is a risk I am willing to take. Lest you forget, my lord, I am not born of this land. My loyalty is to the Lord Commander alone. But I speak only of what may come to pass. If the rumors regarding his heritage are to be believed, we have naught to fear. <laughs> Lies and slander. Forgive me, what rumors are these? That Sir Emmerich is the Archbishop's bastard son. Senior clergy are not permitted to marry and sire children. But even the holiest among us are not immune to temptation. <laughs> I'm able oh to boy. believe it. Sir Emmerich is truly the Archbishop's son. He has never been publicly acknowledged as such. But the rumors have plagued him since childhood. That he rose to his current position, despite being despised as a bastard and accused of profiting from his father's influence, bespeaks the quality of his character. It is my hope that on this occasion, the burden of his birth will work in his favor. Should our worst fears be realized, the Archbishop will not be so quick to execute his own flesh and blood, affording us time to mount a rescue. Bastard or trueborn, he is our nation's best hope. If the Holy See dares to threaten him, I shall lead the charge against the vault myself. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where, where the hell is this coming from? <clears throat> Why? <sighs> okay. Here, here. The future of Ishgard rests on Sir Emmerich's shoulders. I too will do mine utmost to aid his cause. Yeah, because you're a bastard as well. Orshafon, be reasonable. A knight lives to serve, father. To aid those in need. The people need Sir Emmerich more than ever. And we may be his only hope. There is no greater calling for a knight than to save the life of his fellow man. I swear to you, on the sigil of our house, that I shall do this and make you proud. Man, he's great. Not, yeah, of course. <laughs> Romantic, reckless fools, the lot of you. <clears throat> so be it. Make your preparations. I thank you all for your support. Great, great cutscene. This one is love it. Um, let's take a look. Let's talk to her. Though your assistance is most welcome, I fear it will not be enough. I think so as well. Few as we are, we still struggle to reach the Lord Commander. If we are to succeed, we must need to recruit others to our cause. Uh, like I said, I'll just go for the money. Kind of need it. I've been donating my cash to the FC. It, it's mine, so why does what I might as well just donate it to the to free company, right? It's, it's how things go, I think. Eventually, I'll be more rich. Like, I don't need the additional 10 item level. I also think they might not be that amazing. Let's try an item comparison. Like, this one has 5. I can't, Of course, this one has material, which, you know, it's nice. But this blue is white. Yes, the defense is absolute. Actually, it's quite a boost. But the vitality is only 1. The mind is only two. Determination is not even present. Spell speed is faster. Piety. Well, this one has piety. Ah, uh, you know what? I'll just take the money. I'm I'm sure we'll we'll get some new gear. Like at the end, I'm I'm sure I'll, I'll be 
I'll be doing a lot of these tome missions. Or scripts. I've unlocked scripts on my gatherers. So, um, I know I can get to Idleshire. Idleshire? Is it Idleshire? It's Idleshire. Um, and you'll get a mission that you'll have to do. It's like weekly or something. I'm, I'm not particularly sure about it. Like, uh, this is where, that's where I kind of like stopped. Um, I, I went to the diadem. That, that's it. 3.4. Is that 3.3? I think it's 3.3. I went to the diadem. And that's when everything was like, so, okay, okay. Uh, I plan on making a new character anyway. So I just I stopped reading altogether. Uh, but how are we to carry out this bold endeavor? Even with an army of knights at our back, the direct assault on the vault seems unlikely to succeed. You are correct. Not even the assembled might of the house for top and the temple knights would be sufficient. With the support of another party, however, we may yet stand a chance. You speak of one of the other houses? Precisely the opposite. I speak of the revolutionaries rumored to reside in the broom. It was these disgruntled his guardians who opened the gates of our city to the heretics, I believe. Holy shit! But of course, uh, if their hatred of the Holy See drove them to such deeds, they might well be persuaded to assist Sir Emmerich's rescue, knowing the truth he would lay bare. Such is my hope, and I would have you and Daly reach out to them. As a temple knight and a sworn servant of the Holy See, any overtures I make are doomed to fail. But as outsiders... The two of you may receive a warmer welcome. Very well. We shall seek out the leader of these revolutionaries and make our case. My thanks, Assistin. With your brothers, heed your command if you order them to stand aside. Or will your brothers? Oh. Uh, the dragons have no love for politics, my lady. They will gladly watch and wait while the highborn fight amongst themselves. You were highborn as well, like in your lineage. So when did you become so poor? How very wise. We must hurry to the Forgotten Knight. Tataru may have knowledge of these revolutionaries. Okay, let's go. So, uh, Edian, um, if. He, the, I know I always mispronounce your name. Um, you must be excited for the new ex, uh, expansion then. Are you not? Honoring the past? Wait, what's that? Wait, we get an ether current? Wait, 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 wait. For what? Apparently, there is already a mission. So, I can, can I fly in the city? I don't think so. What do you want me to do? We recently held a ceremony to honor the passing of Sir... Blah, 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 blah. Third son of the house, Helenate. But I was surprised to see none of the Rose Knights from Clem uh, Camp Cloudtop in attendance. Not that they should abandon the camp, mind you. But at the very least, I expected to see... Uh, Rontermont, or perhaps Lady Lian Liaite in attendance. I am sure she was. She has her reasons for not attending. But Rontermont is a dear friend of mine, and I know how he cared for for Sir. They were uh, they were quite close, uh, closely together for many years, down to the very end. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, do I need to go there? Which is why I want you to present this to him. The battle standard uh, rised during the ceremony. I'm certain he would have attended if he could. And at the very least, I should think he would appreciate a momentum from the ceremony. Yeah, okay. Which, you know, is great. Deep Digging deeper. Uh, let's turn that off because that is something I am unable to do, I think. This I can turn off. Okay. I don't think I'll do that right now. 
Uh, I don't think I want to go to the Camp Cloud top yet. Like, we'll see what we need to do. Let's go to the... Let's go to Tataru. Tataru. Which is... There. God, I've been worried sick. It's been, it's so good to see you. And you, how did you manage to escape the chaos in the streets? Well, she was just here drinking. Um, so this guy, uh, Gibraltar, Gibraltar, and the other barricaded the doors until the heretics left. No one was harmed, thankfully. But what about you two? You came for your... Um, what came of your journey? <laughs> that scared me. Wait, she's talking? Okay, yeah. You are not serious. What was Sir Emmerick thinking? I mean, the way you two talk about him, I wouldn't have believed. Anyway, I've heard rumors of the people you're looking for, but I doubt they'll be of much use. The only thing I can say with any certainty is that they are led by someone called the mongrel. A queer monkey? Wait, where? Yeah, a, a queerer monkey if ever I've heard one. But mayhap, it will make the individual in question easier to find. Come, uh, let us all make inquiries below. Sure, that's... Warrior of Light, rising to the occasion, questioning people down below. There's one, no one over there. There is actually... Oh, there we go. A broom rat. I don't know a goddamn thing about the mongrel. But if I did, you can be sure I wouldn't tell you. Makes sense. Where well, he's throwing snowballs at him? And at me. Wait, they're all throwing it at me. Ha! Huh, okay. Interesting. Room Elder. Yeah, what was that? Speak up. Can I hear you all too well uh, as I used to. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, that's nice. What are you holding here, the gatekeeper? What are you gatekeeping? Oh, it's off limits. Never mind. Uh, a starveling? A mongrel? Not sure I catch your meaning. To a true blood, we're all the we are all of us dogs down here. Well, I'm I'm not I'm not pure blood. You know, you you, you can tell me. Uh, what do you want? Not a single shred of information, just as I expected. These revolutionaries would not have it as evaded capture for so long without the masses complicity still without the masses complicity still okay it is good to know that Tetris ears are as sharp as ever of course she has information frustrating though it may be we must press on while I continue speaking with the people of the broom why not go and see if Gibraltar knows out of the vault. As the proprietor of the Forgotten Knight, surely he must have heard whispers of the mongrel uh, before. You can only hope that he will be more forthcoming than the others. We were just there. Why didn't we not start there? If he's going to tell us, like, wh why? Okay. 
I'm sure they have our, they have their reasons. Like I know with the new expansion, they will be removing some of the quest. This would be a great quest to remove because that made no sense. Why would I go talk to free people just to be sent back to the inn where I started? Also, how's my gear? Um, yeah, okay, seems good enough. You know, people long for a sympathetic ear, a sympathetic ear, but they need to know what it com that it comes to the right lips, of tight lips. This, um, discretion, that's what my customers expect. If they don't get it, then I don't get them. That being said, I am not without my sympathies. I've heard the tales, and I know you have done right by highborn and lowborn alike. Least I can do is point you in the, the in the right direction. But to do that, I need you to do something for me. So it happens there's a hunt up in the Cro Crozier, who owes oh a hunter in the Crozier who owes me a fair bit of coin. However, I have agreed to accept payment in fresh herbs. Go and get them for me, agreed? Okay, that's over there. Let's move up. Let's move up and go. Yeah, I'm thinking I might just buy gear for my gatherers, but knowing the white scripts. I'm not sure if I want to. I think that we can either craft gear. Or we can get it with tomes. There is there is tomes for crafters and gatherers. I know that. So, your Gibran's errand good. Good, good. Uh, how's he doing? Same as always. Right, right. Any road. I hope he appreciates how much trouble I had to go through on account of his bloody herbs. Tell him to enjoy them while they last, because I doubt I'll be able to find any more next year. Then stop drinking so much, dude. Like, you can't blame him. Like, he is just, you know, uh, trying to make money, I guess. Making ends meet. Well, you going to hand them over or not? Shit, dude. Seriously. Aye. There's all to do. With a few other spices, I can make it just like she used to. There are a few things which stir the heart of men like a sip of malt wine. Share the glass with the right people. And who knows what stories they'll share. Now that I think on it, there is a woman I know who's rather fond of this bland. Herienfia is her name and she resides in the pillars. She's a maid servant to some noble house or another, I forgot. Anyways. Be a sh uh, uh, be a shame if she didn't get to try this wine. Why not give her a bottle? Is this me? See him pointing me in the right direction. Pillars. Uh, 
Astro Club. Yes, I am Arianta, beg your pardon, but do I know you miss? Yeah man, you drink a lot, so here's a bottle. I know the smell, this is the wine that girl used to prepare, a special recipe. It must be decades since I last tasted this. Oh, the poor dear, such a shame that she was taken in by that baron oh no he got a dashing figure i'll grant you that tall slender long of it wait long of ear so that's a sexual thing but these bustling ruby eyes of his were filled with lust it was not more than infatuation that she felt, but she convinced herself it was love, and he couldn't help but take advantage. Nasty, I know, right? In long of ear. Mm-hmm. Oh man, that 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 gives you images. That is. Uh, I don't hope the uh, the aura have the same actually. You know, someone stroking your ears. But when her belly started to grow, God, the scandal. I mean, it's not an uncommon uh, occurrence, but that it was with a, a Hayu made it so much. Well, I needn't tell you. She was discharged from his service, casted out into the streets like so much, uh, like so much refuse. Yeah, I gotta get that population up. Damn right. <laughs> Go ahead, stroking ears. Mm -mm -mm -mm. After she returned to the broom, we drifted apart. I only learned of her death years later by chance. We drifted apart. Like, oh no, the, the filth. Ew. Ew. Uh, we need to go back to the inn. Wait, is this probably... That would be ending me in the broom. Oh, uh, I think I've been going the long way. Damn. This feels like a massive side quest. Uh, of course, I love the story in between it, but damn. So, the Amorous nobleman bet his maidservant, then cast her aside when the seed takes root. <laughs> Holy shit, man, that's so... Man, they have a way with words. Not the most original tale, is it? Called comfort for the women and children who live it, though. True. Child apart. Even the... Penitent can appreciate wine from time to time. Um, take, I hate French names. I just can't deal with them. Uh, Gerald Yux, Geraldo, Gerald. Let's call him Gerald, for example. Surely you've heard of him? Of course not, dude. He is a monk who offers succor to the most poorest of the poor in the broom. A man of many vows but none which prohibit a spirituous beverage. Spirituous beverages. Aye. If ever there was a man who deserved a drink, it'd be him. You're going to be drinking, giving a man a drink that is not allowed to drink. Oh, that's great. Wait. Am I going the right direction? Yeah, I am. There you go. Yeah. 
You don't look like a bro uh, a, a, a monk to me, mate. You look like a manservant. Hello, Niz. Blessing upon you, miss. I a gift for me? Yeah, man. <laughs> we'll make we make the city drunk again. The scent, how reminiscent of a wine once made by a dear old friend. May a soul rest in peace. Forsaken by a family, she toiled tirelessly to feed and clothe a child. Yet somehow she found time to help me tend to those in even worse circumstances. So compassionate she was, so full of love for a fellow man. It was that love which gave her child strength to endure the scorn of the other younglings. That little girl, bless her heart, she couldn't help what she was. Eventually, she won them over. But those first few years were trying. Even more so when she had to start fending for herself. I remember days she spent standing on the walls. Raven black hair flowing in the wind, staring out, as if searching for her mother's face in the mist. Oh, I hate this. Oh, shit, I hate this. I hate sobby tales. Seriously hate sobby tales. I think we need to go back to the inn, yeah. Is it sobby or soggy? I honestly don't know. It sounds about right. It's just, ah, man. I hate emotional shit. Can't deal with that. Hey, here we go. Ah, uh, what do you want? She was a remarkable woman daily. After everything she was forced to endure, she still remained hopeful for the future. For her daughter's future. Okay, plot lines. Some bonds are thicker than blood, but blood still defies us. Any div uh, divides uh, uh, and divides us in the end. It's the legacy of her parents, Daddy, that we can't escape it, and we can't escape it, no matter how hard we try. So the mongrel and her pups chose to embrace theirs. So proclaim it to all and sunder, uh, sundry. Don't know what that means. If you can understand that, then maybe you can find her on your own. Okay. Sure, let me walk all the way there. Again. It's down here somewhere. Okay, you again. Still looking for your mongrel? Like I said before, take your pick. Plenty around. If you don't know where to look, or did you fancy someone specific? Um, I'm looking for a mongrel with ruby red eyes and raven black hair. Ah, someone's got unusual taste. Afraid I can't help you though. Won't, rather. It's bloody obvious aren't you, uh, you aren't from the broom. Did you think I would just tell you because you asked nicely? I, I can give you money. I can give you money. I can get you out of the slums. <laughs> oh, man. It's just, just age. Just give me money, I'll tell you, okay? Money makes the world go round. Could also go over that stairs, but uh, I refuse. Fra Flaming Dragon. Cool name. It's also this sad under sound. Okay, so don't we need to go to the innkeeper anymore? We can now go to Alfino. Have you made any progress? Yeah, it's because I, I, I that, that's why I'm here. So, our mongrel was born of an Elgian uh, nobleman and a Hyronian maidservant. 
granted it is no look it is no location but it is far more information than we had before yes now that the striking features are known to us mayhap we need only remain vigilant Just give me more money I'll, I'll i'll take the money level 57 damn okay three more levels and we reach the end then there must be a way we can draw the mongrel out into the open Mayhap we should discuss this with Tataru. Speaking of which, where is Tataru? Oh, confound it. She went below to make inquiries on her own, didn't she? We must find her quickly. I have a premonition. This is not going to end well. Okay, so Tataru dies then. We need to go... Oh, well, not there. Huh? Definitely the wrong direction. Oh, wait, that's destination. Search for Tataru. No, go to the destination. Yeah, I'm not reading that. I bet we're going to be over here. Okay, maybe not. She must be around here somewhere. I can take... Uh, I take it you had no luck either. Well, I'm sorry. I forgot I said anything. Wait, down there. Isn't that Tataru? Those men are chasing her quickly after them. You're going, Missy. I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend. What's going on here? Wait, we know him. We've seen him before. Was it you, boy? Piss off. Hold on. I've seen them around. They're yeah. in and out of House Four Tom's Manor all the time. Yep. That's us. Oh, I see. Skulking about at your highborn master's bidding, eh? Bloodhounds hoping to catch a whiff of heresy, is that it? You are quite mistaken, I assure you. We came here to help. And if you know what's good for you, you will let us pass. We came here to help. But if you don't listen, we'll slap you silly. <laughs> <laughs> listen to the pups yapping. Come here, boy. I'll give you cause to yelp. Yo, MC, how you doing? Enough! Leave threatening women and children to our betters. We don't have the knack. Hilda! Oh, she has tiny ears. Ah, oh, she looks nice. Lay a finger on the blue blood's pups, and you're like to lose the hand. In often I get called on by glorious heroes like yourself. So tell me, what have I done to deserve you? Oh, it's not voice, damn. Before you start, let's go somewhere a bit more private, eh? 
The Forgotten Night. Again to the Forgotten Night. <clears throat> a cool day with rain. Okay, so is that a good thing or a bad thing? I like because I'm going to assume you're either now in. You are in the in fall? No, spring. I don't know. I completely forgot. Um, I'm doing. I'm a bit busy currently, constantly, and I'm I'm getting annoyed by it. But I can't stream as much. My shifts are weird. Um, but otherwise, I'm doing good. Thank you. So I'll I'll make best of what I can with a very limited time. I've like this week. I can only stream like once. I hate it. Next week, hopefully twice well we spring but uh, the heat away from wow oh yeah man yeah the, the heat is always a bit of a annoyance isn't it so yeah you must be welcoming rain like crazy how do you survive the heat man i go absolutely mental when it's like 35 degrees outside i'll just just lay on the sofa and not move i just refuse to move a muscle Okay, well, she bring these two guys with her who were threatening Tataru. Why? We're actually being up-leveled. Now, that's interesting. You are below the recommended level for this question. Yeah. I don't care. Below the recommended level? No. I'm a healer, like, I don't care. It's a bomb. No. <laughs> yeah, just, when it's like that hot, I am definitely not turning on my computer. My wife calls my computer like a, a sort of a heat source. So I'm not even allowed to turn it. So I'm happy it's currently like fall. We're getting to the winter. And then hopefully we'll get some more time to stream that would be nice i'm I'm actually thinking i was talking about this with lord doctor about picking up star trek online and hopefully assisting the discord by getting more members because it's uh it's been going slowly for for star trek online so while you're on your way to kill nidhogg you stumbled on some dirty secrets that the holy sea has been hiding for centuries <laughs> Hey, what are they on about? The high houses. And what makes a nobleman so bleeding noble? They trace their blood back to King Thordon and his Knights Twelve, the founders of Ishgard. But our friends here reckon we're all descended from the heroes of Eld. Highborn and lowborn alike. True. And so Sir Emmerich, Lord Commander of the Temple Knights, has gone to ask the Archbishop if he wouldn't mind letting everyone know. <laughs> I love her. This is so good. Is he simple? The old bastard will have him executed for heresy. <laughs> Thank you. Is he simple? Yeah, he is simple. Well, seems to me that's what the good sir wants. Seems he thinks a noble sacrifice will serve to prove his claims. We cannot stand idly by and allow Sir Emmerich to do this. Ishgard has need of him. Look, you've a good heart, I can see that. Willing to risk your neck for someone else even when his troubles ain't yours. But what's this got to do with me? Yeah, yeah, MC, you know, you do what you do. By the end of the day, you know, we're content creators. Uh, whether it's not for hobby or not, like we play games mainly for ourselves, and the enjoyment of others to watch. Um, and we can actually expect others to try to do their thing in the Discord as well. And so far that's not been happening. I've been talking with Lord Doctor about changing and, and stuff. And, and he's actually gone to a point where he says like once my, my computer is up to specs. He is going to be looking for more people to stream Star Trek online and and do things with that as well so we can actually assist 
But you know, that, that, that sounds nice, but if it's actually going to happen, I don't know. I don't know. I've been very fortunate with the people I've found for Final Fantasy. Even though there has been drama, people leaving, you know, feeling like stabbing in the back and stuff like that. I did find a few people who have been great and they have been really blowing up the um, the free company. Like we're at 114 members, I believe. And F Final Fantasy right now is the second largest role on the Discord but there is no chat in, you know, because they're mainly like in the game. Final Fantasy is so story heavy that you can play the story by yourself. You don't need anything. So Star Trek Online, especially when you when you start doing the end game stuff, there is a lot of things you can do with groups. And it's always nice uh, when you have that group going. And you have your Star Trek Online friends who are in a different guild. So I can definitely imagine like... You have other things to do than just go spamming people to join us. You know, you, you want to have a great time playing a game, and that's basically what we do. If Sir Emmerich is imprisoned in the vault, we will need all the help we can muster to breach their defenses and rescue him. in the hells well that's not how you go down ah the unmistakable scent of heresy oh I hate that guy and what do we have here the honored guests of House for Tom consorting with the Queen of Rats. Ooh, plotting insurrection, I shouldn't wonder. That won't do. Sickness is wont to fester and spread. It must be burnt out ere the infection takes hold. I reckon Sir would be happy to wield the irons himself. Well, so happens. I've got irons of my own. You know, it, it's a thing called a Discord fatigue. Everything has a Discord. Um, they're part of a the STO community. Now, if you're there and you're active on it, then yeah, of course, I get it. Uh, that's why I'm not active in any community but the uh, our own. Um, it also doesn't help that not very many people know of STO. Just keeping. Yeah, I've I've look, when I when you look at uh, Twitch, like. Taking a look at how many people watch Star Trek Online, like in comparison to uh, World of Warcraft, Path of Exile, Final Fantasy, yeah, and it's 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 somewhat niche. It is small, yeah, for sure. Like I'll take a look right now. Um, Twitch browsing uh, categories. Like, there's currently 2,000 people watching Final Fantasy Online. And Star Trek... Oh yeah, it's actually called SDO in here, right? No, Star Trek Online. Star Trek Online. It didn't even get up there. Um, holy shit, there is... No one, no one currently streaming Star Trek Online. That is what I usually had with the game uh, X4. I was the only guy streaming, so they follow me, they watch me because they're interested in someone and there is no, no one to do anything else. Yeah, Discord Fatigue. Discord Fatigue 
is when you open Discord and you see, like if I show you my screen right now, quickly, um, this one, and you have this option over here, right? So I usually have it like this. Yeah, this is all of the Discord I'm part of. I I never go here. I never go here. Sorry, MC. Never go here. Never go to EgoSoft. Never go to Final Fantasy. I never go to the Balance. Uh, this one I I I joined because I was invited. Vampire. Uh, actually, you know what? Yes, Leaf. Community. Path of Exile. I'm there because me and my wife play the game. Uh, the housing is for the houses. And and you have so many, but you never go there. You have that too, precisely. So for me personally, if 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 I was part of Discord, right, I wanted to make sure that people are as active as possible. Like, believe it or not, like if I go to my own Discord, right? Um you don't have to open that Discord, I have it open over here. And I go to server guide. We have 354 members. 71 people online. Do you see any chatter? Like, there is some community content. I, I don't even watch it. Let's see, I can actually have to scroll down. I never go there. Some talk about cuisine. Like... Actually, that's a new guy posting something that's cool. Uh, some housing, some cats, some tech support, which is usually just a dump. People joining, yeah, Genesis posting his game automatically. He's never there. Some talk, tiny bit of talk, and that's it, you know. There, there's nothing huge going on. It's, it's, it's quiet. And that's the majority of... Thank you so much. Appreciate that. That the majority of people that join Discord, they join it now. They join it in the hope that they like it. And if they don't like it, we shove it into a folder. We mute everything of the Discord. And we never go there ever again. So in my... Maybe in, in my very tiny perception you would say it's been five minutes since last activity so okay we definitely have to go into it so i would love it if you say like if someone has not been in a discord for over three months they'll immediately be moved out this way people will remain more active in a discord because they want to be there on the other hand, you'll lose the members and people. And we know, I want to get to 500 members because there is some perks which might generate more members. You know, it makes no sense, actually. But anyways, uh, that's me renting again. Let's just continue with the game. That's a freakishly good shield, man. Simple creatures, rats. Certain to attack when cornered. Let us step outside, my lady. In here, your toys could hurt someone. And that's the reason I wanted to bring more content creators together into one Discord. Because we can actively stop Discord fatigue together by just grouping up, making it more interesting. But it, it, it's difficult. Finding people with the, the same ideals, liking some of the same games. Uh, because I, I've learned by now that just grabbing everyone that wants to is not helpful. We need to focus on either Final Fantasy and Star Trek Online. Like the MMO parts of things. I think for us as the Discord, it, it's MMOs that's more interesting. Maybe even Path of Exile, it's not really an MMO, but it has, like Diablo 4, some MMO aspects. So bringing them together, but everyone is so uptight about, oh no, it's my little corner on the internet and I'm now going to lose it. No you don't. 
no, you don't. Not at all. Like, I don't make the rules. We make them together. And if something is needed, then we'll create it together. And, and hopefully at some point, when we find someone who's a Twitch, uh, who's sponsored by Twitch, I don't know, he can make a team. And we can grow from a community into a team. And we can actively support each other. And now, now I'm definitely stopping the rent. <laughs> I want to play. Okay, so we're a bit underleveled. I thought they would sink us. Apparently they just don't. Okay. Uh, no, not that one. Go here. And let's start spamming. Some skills. So we need to make sure they like live and the temple surgeons eventually they will die. Let's give myself a bit of regen. And I definitely want to get that AoE dot up. <laughs> Meep. Uh, yeah, I don't I never like it when I start renting and, and I'm 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 way too good at renting. So what I need to do is get three cards and then I can do a better skill. Okay, let's start bringing them together. I might die, just so you know. Aspect of Helios. There is a surgeon, he needs to die immediately. He's starting to heal everyone, he's going to be dreadful. So annoying. But we can actually bring them together. Keep in mind, now Elfie not actually, now they're somewhat close together, now we can start spamming the same skill again. Okay, so here we go, F8. A bit, bit closer, a bit closer, I don't know why they keep standing in that circle. You know, it's not going to help them. Uh, Ruby is chasing me, apparently. We definitely have our oh shit skill when we need to. And with the oh shit skill, I'm referring to the uh, aspect of... No, not aspect of benefit. It is essential dignity, which I think restores the character's full HP. Let's go check it out. Well, that didn't work the way I intended it. Well, whatever. Um, Pelone, guide my sword. Yeah, fine, mate. You you go attack this guy. We're getting assistance here, which is great. Carbuncle, Ruby only. There's another surgeon. Filthy surgeon race. down first. Okay, let's heal myself. I kind of don't want to die. I think that might be the last of the reinforcements. Yeah, so far it's not... This is not too difficult for you playing like um, a healing class. But oh man... I had a sh absolute disgusting time when I was playing as a melee. Elfie not is is a uh, a scholar, so he's not the best of uh, healers. He is not getting damage, is he? Four percent. Yeah, look at that. Barrier preventing damage. So let's get the hell out of here because I don't want to damage the others. Give myself regen. Well, that's it. That's done. That was easy. That was nothing to complain about. There's no denying your gifts. A well-deserved reputation indeed. Enough! 
What are you doing? Oh, wow, he, he makes Dragoons proud. He is a Dragoon, right? Yeah, he has a spear on his back. Oh, found ourselves an Athletic. Lucky bastard. Nay, tis we who are lucky. Had we fought on, t'was but a matter of time before our conflict claimed the life of an innocent bystander. I thought the Heaven's Ward might come here as well. They came to the Temple Knight's headquarters. Yeah, I think Sir Emmerich has been held now captive. Aye. Sir Grino announced that the Lord Commander had been imprisoned under suspicion of heresy, and that the Heaven's Ward had been granted full authority in his stead. Seems like we need to do a dungeon soon then. Those still loyal to Sir Emmerich answer to me. Alas, that amounts to but half our number. The other half, who opposed his promotion to Lord Commander, have gathered at the vault as ordered. Bolster in the guard already, eh? If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were expected. I take it you're in charge around here? Hilda, and yes, the young master was just persuading me to join his lost cause. Convincing little beggar, isn't he? Ten minutes remain to complete fire and blood? What? There's a time limit on this quest I, even when you're watching the cinematic? A bit. That, and the fact that we're sick of living off the leavings of our betters. <laughs> oh man, I think she is now my new favorite character. Never mind to change things around here. Then we've a mind to join you. Yeah, I know, right? Like, come on, man. I'm watching the cinematic. I'm enjoying it. And they're like, man, you got ten more ten more minutes, man. Ten more minutes, and then you know it's time. It it it's done. <laughs> okay. Uh that's a problem, I think. Level 75. We are underleveled. And we are unable to do it until we level. Uh, so it means we're going to be starting the mission as um, as a Dark Knight. We're already underleveled now. Let me guess. You're wondering why I chose the mongrel, right? It's uh, because it's what I am. I am not ashamed of it. Not anymore. Besides, even my pure blood pups have more in common with me than the lords and ladies up on high. Then uh, they, none of them, are well bred. Hells, some of their mothers were cast out on the spot for fun. Same as mine. Story old as time. And no, uh, and one we're sick of hearing. Which is why we look up, we took up arms. Not that we mean to hold all the blue bloods to account. Some have done right by us. I'll allow, um, I will allow like them in house. Helenate, uh, cause you know all about that, wouldn't you? Eh? But enough talk, your friend's still rotting in the cell, let's not keep him waiting. Wait, are we going to a dungeon right now? Like, I kind of don't want to go into, like, eh, maybe as a... Oh, you got to be kidding me, I fucking leveled up by that. If I change back right now. 75. I can actually accept it, but I cannot finish it. That is such bullshit. We've been working in secret to undermine the Holy See and the High Houses. That much is acknowledged. Uh, 
But this nonsense about throwing wide the gates of heretics is just that, nonsense. If not you, then who? Your temple knights, of course. Reckon it was your beloved Sir Emmerich's doing at first, but then I heard how he lost his head. My next best thing would be the Heaven's Ward. The way they have the prefect excuse to go door to door through the broom, slaughter the heretics and their sympathizers in one fell swoop. But the Heaven's Ward scheme did not account for Lady Icehart's intervention. And so they have been forced to improvise. A fine bloody mess, ain't it? But... The die is cast, so what's the plan? We must divert the attention of the high houses away from the city. And to do that, we need to... Cooperate... We need the cooperation of your allies in your service. And that makes you think I have friends in high... And what makes you think I have friends in high places? You would be... Fools... Not to give... Uh, not Wait, wait... You would be fools not to give in your goals. Lowborn knights are ideal recruits. Most sworn fealty only out of desire for a better life. I offered an opportunity to shed the yoke and live for themselves. Who amongst them would not at least be tempted to take it? Rare is the man eager to die for a cause he does not hold dear. But I need not to come uh, but it need not come to that this day. If they and their fellow knights are deployed afield to deal with a new threat, a massing of heretics, for example, then they will be unable to join the defense of the vault. Hmm. Spread false reports of an attack and get them out of harm's way, you mean? The city will not soon forget the heretics' last assault. If the high houses believe another, another attack is imminent, they will have no choice but to act. Can it be done? I think it can. We can trick them into leaving Ishgard. Aye. We can keep them out for long, not bloody likely. Make sure you're ready before I send word, because you won't get a second chance at this. Then it's decided to the vault. The Archbishop must be held to account. And the Lord Commander granted his liberty. Okay, so we actually are going to a dungeon then. But I do hope we can actually get this character leveled, uh, which is a very unlikely considering I need 300,000 XP. Uh, we can quickly do a leveling quest over here. Needs a tank. Yeah, that's a lie. Let's go. Quickly do a dungeon. Get that level up so I don't have to switch with, um, with my Dark Knight. The idea is actually to level them both. Oh, this one. I've not done this. In, in, I've done this forever. Let's go. Hi. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't have the area of effect anymore. That maiden is coming in because he didn't pay attention, which is fine. Get the key. Get the key. Come on, get the key. You, if you start running like that, you will die. Sorry, was getting the key. Don't die again, please. That would be so awkward. Don't run out like that, mate. I don't have my... Ah, oh man, I hate not having my regen. Fucking annoying. 
That's fine, I want to keep going, it's a, let me, yeah, yeah, sure. Unless he starts doing that. Okay, do a quick heal, I'll be focusing a bit more on him because I feel bad now, you know. But I was getting the key, and he was getting, uh, he was get, he was getting out of, um, out of my vision. Yeah, he turned aggro on, that's true, that's true, I'm not saying anything, but without the key, we could not go into this door. He doesn't have to take that, but he will, and he will start moving, which is fine. No, he's doing great, so far. Okay, get the aggro, that's one. He will go... This will be a battle. Oh my god. Like, okay. So, this is going to be rough. Let's get a Stuna. Because he does not want to have that poison. Please. If the others get hit, that's going to be annoying. Okay. Honestly, I have no clue what kind of a skill I actually gave him. Damage dealt is increased. Yeah, okay. So I actually did do the right card on him. He's doing great damage, though. He is. So I now I feel super bad that I have top. He, I should actually have the other two get the key. So I could focus on the tank, you know. Kind of my job as a healer is just making sure he doesn't die. He's Roban's left arm. Oh my god. <laughs> That's a cool name. Oh, that is great. Let's get that up again. Let's get out of this. Yeah, he doesn't have to move like he's a tank. I do have to move. Especially because I'm in a different um, part of the world. Like, I'm, I'm playing on the NA server. And... This is definitely not the easiest then. Okay, let's give him another heal, just so he likes it. And then we go up that direction. Yeah, he got the key. Great. I'll greet it, because I will always need Grand Company Seals. Been spending them like crazy. Go jump down. Yeah, platoon is not helpful because we're actually going to be in a battle. Okay, I need to rush. Yeah, he's doing it again. He uh, he will need a heal the second he stops moving. He's taking a lot. So yeah. Hopefully, DPS will be able... I don't have any areas of effect skills I could use on him. And they need to stop right now. Heal, Astuna. Give him another heal. I got... I'm being attacked. I'm being attacked. I'm being attacked. Please don't attack me. Please don't attack me. Please. Please. I'm, I'm being attacked. Help. Oh, help me. Help me, please. I'm being attacked. Come on, man. Oh, I'm so close. Oh, I did not like that. Please. Oh, that was so close. Come on, get that up. Oh, that was so damn close. That's not good. Ooh, so close. No, 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 no. You need a yellow key. <sighs> oh, I... Actually, no, you probably... Yep. The 
This way, this way. This way, dude. <laughs> I'm, over here. I'm over here. Oh, fuck. What do you. F Just get over here, dude. Oh, you joking. Never mind. I'm away. I'll just run. Oh. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'm, I'm like, come on, dude. Seriously? Like, he's doing that great, but now that... Oh, of course they are done. Now they're going there. You're joking. You're joking. <laughs> oh, well, you know, it's fine. That looks good. You don't, please don't tag him, it doesn't matter. I will do both anyways. Okay, it's fine. If, if he pulled, like the other one pulled, and he jumped over the barricade, I could have healed him. And by not doing so, he will make it difficult. Man, I don't even have any any sort of area heal, which is somewhat annoying. I don't have regen. Ah, oh, man, I've not done this in a while. Let's get a Stuna on our ninja. He will kind of want to move as fast as possible, I'm assuming. So, w w all we need to do is level. All we need to do is level. And then we can do the vault. I've done the vault once. Just once. Bloody parchment. Get the bloody parchment. There we go. <clears throat> okay, final boss. Final boss time. I, I remember leveling other classes. I've done this dungeon so many times. He's actually very fast at that. And I'll definitely... Definitely doing great. He has also it's, it's very cool close. Oh so yeah. I'm doing nice. Uh, yeah, no one's first time with the exception of... Cargo? No. Okay, we need to stay close to her. Since she will summon that damn eye. Right now, so definitely want to get... Like so. Hopefully, he will switch... Over. And he did. Just in the nick of time. Great. Well played. Okay, so let's get it on him. Let's get DPS on that. Stuna. Give him a quick heal. Okay, get the hand Lady Handmaiden. I think we need to kill her first. I'm not sure if it's like obligated or very necessary. So next is the eye on the side. We will start moving towards it. There we go. Yeah, easy fight. Great timing on that. Although, yeah, maybe. Yeah, you know, it's just 1%. There you go. Uh, GG. Okay, definitely recommending the tank. He did great. There we go. Okay, now we should have leveled. Yeah, we're level 57. We can do the vault now. 
Hearken to me, everyone. We have two objectives. Rescue Sir Emmerich and apprehend the Archbishop. We will therefore divide our forces into two parties. Assistin and I will make ready to breach the underground Goal. Gaol? And search for the Lord Commander. We will not move, however, until the second party has entered the vault. I speak of your party, Warrior of Light. Together with Lord Horshafon and Master Alfinot, for this part to succeed, uh, you will need to fight your way into the highest level of the vault, even into the Archbishop's private chambers. When the Heavens Ward realize what you intend, uh, they will fly. It's, uh, they will fly to the master's side, leaving only a token force of guards uh, to guard the uh, the gaol. Temple knights loyal to our cause uh, have already secured the entrance to the vault. Once you are within, they will signal to us. If all goes to plan, we shall rejoin you with Sir Emmerich and confront the Archbishop together. It's every, uh, is everyone clear as to their duties? Then let us do what must needs be done. All right? Let's go. Now uh, I I remember uh, I remember doing that dungeon. Uh, I was doing it as a healer. Uh, damn, this is one of the biggest parts of the entire MSQ. Yeah, you know it, it actually is. Like you don't travel as much, and you do uh, definitely talk a lot uh, with everyone. But I remember doing the vault at the final boss. Like I died. As a healer, like, there's something going on. I didn't know what the hell was going on. I probably still don't. Uh, like, I died. And the party cleared the boss without me. I've never felt so useless in my life. I'm like, yeah, that's nice. Like, I was happy for them that they actually managed. But holy shit. That was so sad. Let's go. Onward to the vault. I was not trying to look up my ass. NL. Cool. Um. No life. Never mind. Not everything stands for the Netherlands. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, going to be enjoying that. Are the others in position? I will send word once you and your party have entered. Here we go, the vault. Now accessible. Uh, here we go. Uh, level 75, which is great. I probably will level clear selection. Go. And yeah. Item level average 115, meaning we do have a tiny bit more. We now have regen, we have aspect of the Helios, which I will most likely do these two constantly. Uh, we need to make sure that div uh, divination is up. Uh, drawing the cards, get into the Astrodyne. And um, yeah, I think that would be enough if... Yeah, then it's fine, let's go. Okay, come on, man. Come on, just, 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 just a tank. Just a tank. There we go. Well, let's hope I don't fuck up. And here we stand. Alright. So we have a Dark Knight. So let's start with a regen. And I can quickly do one card. Oh, 
It's more than two or three enemies. Yeah, these are just fodder. Go. And this card is for a DPS or a healer. Okay, great. Did I just press the wrong button? I did. That's stupid. Oh, wow. He got, he got hit. Why? And this one is for a DPS or a tank. Okay, so um, first boss, definitely aspect of the alias. Uh, needs to go in. And he's going forward. So someone is taking, like, okay, this is taking too long, which is flawless. Yeah, I don't like it when people start doing that. That's so annoying. Just, just let, the do, let the tank do what they need to do, man. Actually, he is the tank. Wow, he is a f nice looking damn sword. Holy shit. Okay, I'll try to pay a bit of attention to what's going on. Okay, let's get regen in. Get that, which is DPS or healer. I'm a DPS or healer, so I'll take it for myself. Okay, what the hell is going on? Oh, great. Oh, yeah, that's nice. They grow. Okay, uh, I need the Helios. Give him the regen as well. Which usually should be enough. Oh, wow. Yeah, he takes a shit ton of damage. Like I'm trying... Ooh, these balls? What's going on with these balls? Oh, they go boom. Oh, I don't like it when balls go boom. Okay, we can go there now. There is something else over there. Okay, let's go with the Helios again. Hey, you don't go center stage unless you're going to prepare for something amazing. Ooh, that was not good for me. Yeah, that was too close. We're down to the inner circle. Loot. I'll, I'll take a look at chat right now. I don't want to, like, really, like, butcher this up. So I'm sorry. Okay, we got that, which is for a ranged or a ranged DPS. Uh, which I think he is, actually. Not sure if he is. I don't remember all of these. Um, these okay, we need to run. I don't... I hate corners. <laughs> Line of sight, brother. Line of sight. Like, I, you, I, I don't expect... I'm a, I'm a bloody doctor, not a miracle worker. Okay, let's go. Do some DPS. Okay. So far, so good. Uh, where we stand uh, Where we stand It's the house Mormon Modo for the Game of Thrones Really? Looks like he has the T weapon Like I don't have any of, of, of T weapons uh, I'm not particularly sure what a T weapon Like is I still have my oh shit skill For when things really go sour Let's not be hit by that That would be awkward
Okay, definitely the aspect of the Helios. If they give me some time to actually do it would be I'll nice. We can pieces. do it like this. Did we already fight this guy? Isn't it the guy with the lens? I will not yield to you. Uh, this one is for range DPS or healer. I'm going to be greedy. Man, he has some cool ass skills. Down with you. Okay, let's go. Well, what's going on over there? Get close. Another one of those balls. Okay, aspect of the Elias. Got another regen on him. Give him a heal quickly. Dispel that. Now there's something else over there. Man, I don't like that. It's so ominous. I'm sure it's nothing. Like, I'm worried sick about that. I just don't like it. You know, new dungeons are new dungeons, right? Like, you don't know what's going to happen. 0.01, that's easy. Oh, he is definitely not a ranged, he is a reaper. Then that buff that I gave him was useless. And it's from the Epic Alexander for, I still need to do that. Um, and the same with the, there is this Bohemoth dungeon or something, um, that is six parts. And I've been told it is so long that it will take me several hours to do, like synced. Right? So, I'm very negative about it. Like, oh, I might need to heal him first, actually. Get the Helios. I'm taking the coffin, man. I don't care. I, ne I need it. I need it. Hey, Go. Like, I don't know if it's true. Like, uh, I haven't done it either. It's one of the hardest... Pla oh, wow. Okay, that's good to know. Thank you. Appreciate that. I, I need to get a group up for that. Like, eight, I need eight people at some point to be very patient with me. <laughs> um, basically, because I'm, I'm slow. I'm slow. I'm not denying that. I am absolutely slow. Okay, there we go. DPS. Getting out of that. Are you attacking me? No fucking way. Uh, what the fuck? Aspect of the Helios. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, I'm recommending trying whatever you can. Savage tears. For okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, I need to read that later. Sorry. Sorry. I, 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 will, I will. I will. I will. Um, I will. For sure. This is, this is where I, I freaking died. Like, I don't know what happened. Like, there's walls of fire, like, everywhere. Uh, yeah, Nick, I'm trying to current Savage Tear at first. Ultimate is kind of oh, not a ball game. My ultimate experience is trying to prog the weapons. Fine, which is at least five current state, which is the okay place to start to think. I, I did the Behemoth Extreme synced, which I did by accident. Yeah, this is definitely where I died. Filthy rats. So he will summon at some point these. I don't know what the fuck they were, man. Okay, that, that's something I don't want to be in. Did I get damage from that again? I don't think so. Just keep it up. There we go. He's going to the side. I'm going... Oh, oh my. Oh, I think they might have killed me. 
Wait, what? What's going on? And now the final cut. Uh, okay, so we need to kill these. Uh, I don't need your mercy, mate. I just need you to leave me the heck alone. Okay, let's give me a regen. Okay, 50%. So we are most likely looking at this to be another thing we need to do. There's the, like, the, the riders of the apocalypse. Get out of here. Yeah, they killed me. For sure. Yeah, and they killed him as well. Oh, look out, get out, get out. Okay, uh, I'll do this and then I'll quickly get that idiot thing up. Yeah, come on, do it. Please. Sh sh don't die. Okay, so, yeah. Did we do it? Did we do it? Heff yeah, man. We did. Woohoo. Thank you. Appreciate that. I'm a complete disaster sometimes. I get way too anxious. I get way too anxious. Ah. <sighs> Uh, but the the, the 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 five trials of the five or six like trials. I right, thank you. Um, GG, thank you. Uh, player recommendation. There's only one guy remaining. Greet, 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 greet. Yeah, he wait. He is guy. Look, he wants to be a mentor, right? He wants to be a mentor. So he waited because he knew, he knew he's going to get that recommendation. Okay, so we, we got 132. I can't complain about that. Um, okay, let's go. Well, actually, man, we did great. Love that. Whew. Exciting times. Oh. Yeah, we beat you once. How can this be? <sighs> I know, man. I'm just good. Oh, wait, another fight. Fall back. Damn, he got a ship. I forgot to take pictures. This I need to remember that. I've been using pictures to um, get my thumbnails going, you know. I don't do anything else for, for YouTube, but uh, <laughs> just get the thumbnails going. Wait, what did they, what did they do with his arm? For a mercy, we were not too late. Uh, yeah, we see that, dude. He's still alive. Why must you do this, father? He is the just... is fallen. There is no need for further deception. Now is the time to renounce the lies which led us down this path. To start anew. Yeah, he's fucking amazing. Look at that face, man. And tear down the very pillars of our society. Our history, our values, everything we have built over a thousand years. <sighs> a fool to the last. Look out! 
out! Oh man. Go, as his law awaits. No way, dude. Oh, I don't like that. No. Lord Oshafon. Fuck. No, 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 no. <sighs> it's no good. The wound is too deep. It refuses to mend. You... you are unharmed. Forgive me. I could not bear the thought of... of... Fuck. <clears throat> oh, do not look at me so. A smile better suits a hero. Okay, it's moments like these that I'm very happy that I selected a female character. That would have been awkward for me. Well, that sucks. I know not what to say. The others, they, they are get it at four times mana. The others are pleasant.
Don't. Please. A knight lives to serve, to protect, to sacrifice. There is no greater calling. Leave me to mourn and give chase for my son and for the nation he loved. Go! His sacrifice shall not be forgotten. Bye. <clears throat> I I could not stand there in silence, but uh, uh give me a second. Yeah, man, that's adequate music. Yeah, he is, he is such a fucking good guy. <sighs> okay. When all the others had forsaken us, Lord Harshifan took us in, our beacon of hope in a world of darkness. He did his utmost to raise our spirits, so that we might face our troubles with courage with conviction so that we might face them as as knights we we must press on with our mission Tataru please return to our duties at the forgotten night or your duties let us go speak with Sir Emmerich I worry for his well-being. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> well, that's really putting a gloom. F Damn. My friends, I am in your debt. Think nothing of it. Your wounds are healing well, I trust. Wow. Some wounds do not heal. True. Founding. 
The scriptures a thousand years of lies, all to deceive the common man. <coughs> Nay, our own brothers and sisters. For the blood of the Knights Twelve flows within all our veins. You knew this to be true. You knew, and you concealed it. I should be interested to hear how you came by this knowledge. But yes, you have the right of it. The architects of Ishgard, King Thorden and his knights twelve, entrapped and butchered the great worm, Ratatoske that they might partake of her eyes and thereby transcend their mortal limits. Upon learning of their treachery, Nidhogg was <coughs> consumed with a murderous and justified rage. I dare say you know what followed. The Great Worm slew the king and half of his knights. Aye, but Nidhogg was subdued and his eyes plucked from their sockets by the knights that remained. Their one mistake was to show mercy, for from his brother Hreisvelger did Nidhogg receive a new eye, thus rejuvenating his form and empowering him to embark upon an eternal <coughs> quest for vengeance. Whilst Thorden's son Haldreth took one of Nidhogg's eyes and learned to wield its power in defense of his people. Thus was the first Azure Dragoon born, and ever since that time, his honored successors have risen to drive Nidhogg from our lands whenever the worm has returned to plague us. I ask you, my son, will you answer for my sin? Will your son and his son answer for me as well? What do you mean? If a man cannot atone for his sins in the course of his all too fleeting life, must his progeny then be held to account? Must every subsequent generation be judged as well? Thorin's betrayal of Ratatoska was an unconscionable, unforgivable sin. Should we then, as his descendants, meekly surrender ourselves to an eternity of punishment? Nay, say I, I would not see our children sacrificed in a vain attempt to appease an implacable foe. Dragons are not like us, my son. To they who live forever, the wrongs of antiquity are as those of yesterday. No reparations shall ever suffice. This fact alone should serve as ample justification for our actions. Yet some refuse to see it as such. For men like you, who yearn to commit themselves to a nobler cause, a more compelling narrative is required. This is your solution. This is how you protect our people. You have given us a lost cause, a death sentence, with your compelling narrative. You but doom our countrymen to give their lives for a lie. And they do so gladly. Highborn and lowborn alike are proud to serve, to fight and die for their country. And what would you say to them? What would you tell the wives who have lost their husbands? The mothers who have lost their sons? That their loved ones died for naught? I... Uh... Over the course of a thousand years, countless men have donned these robes, and every one of them came to accept the necessity of this solution. Once, I hoped you might come to accept it as well. Once.
Do not despair, my son. Soon I shall free us from the sins of antiquity and bring about the change you so fervently desire. If he has spoken with others, I would have their names. Escort him to a cell and question him. Thoroughly. Your Eminence. You saw something, did you not? A vision of the past? So this is the power of the Echo. Would that it had shown you a finer moment from my past. Yeah. T'was an exercise in futility, as you saw. Faced with the firmity of his conviction, and his many ready rejoinders, my words deserted me. To be frank, I am embarrassed to recall it. A friend once impressed upon me the importance of differentiating between words, deeds, and beliefs. Were he here, I suspect he would judge your father's conviction to be no more than rank, self-serving delusion. Even so, I cannot help but wonder what manner of change he intends to bring about. I have given some thought to that as well. During the battle within the vault, the Heaven's Ward demonstrated strange and unnatural abilities. Aye, the manner in which Sir Zephyrin struck down Lord Horshafon was unlike anything I've ever seen before. The spectacle called to mind King Thordon and his Knights Twelve as they are depicted in scripture. Holy powers and all. Mere fabrications, which have become objects of faith, instilled with the belief of countless devoted souls. Seven hells! If Lady Iceheart can use her own body as a vessel for summoning, I see no reason why others could not. Are the Heaven's Ward truly so reckless? Unbelievable! As they fled, my father spoke of Aziz La. Though I know not what he intends, I fear no good shall come of it. His ambitions are too great, and his minions too powerful. We must find the Heaven's Ward and stop my father before it is too late. I, Emmerich, Lord Commander of the Temple Knights of Isgard, do hereby enter of entreat the aid of the Science of the Seventh Dawn. Our aid in preventing whatever it is that the Archbishop intends. Your aid in bringing him to justice. Too much blood has been spilled for the lies he perpetuated no more. I shall punish him to the end of the world if I must to live life for death. I will have Sir Zephyrin's heart for what he did to Oshifond. Yeah, I'm going to butcher him up. Yes, yes, of course, you too. Yeah, uh, we're close, I know. This <laughs> is so fun, whatever. 
Much has changed since our order's founding, but our duty in combat the primal threat has not. If the Archbishop and the Heaven's Ward are guilty of crimes of summoning, then Daly and I will stop them. Would that I could join you in the pursuit, but alas, my father's absence has thrown our government into chaos. Ever since the founding of our nation, there has been an Archbishop to serve as a guiding light for the masses, a force for stability to counterbalance the High House's ceaseless maneuvering. Convincing the people to recognize the truth of our origin would have been difficult even with my father's support. The road ahead is that much more fraught with peril without it. Yet walk it we must, for unity is more vital for our survival than ever. After all, Nitok's death did not mark the cessation of Dravanian hostilities. Cessation, yeah, cessation of hostilities. Far from it, we will have great need for each other in the days to come. You may ever count on my land, Sir Emmerich. To my dying breath, I shall defend Isgard from the Horde. If I may, Lord Commander, I would like to assist the science in the search for the Archbishop. Pray attend to me outside. Very well. With me there, I believe we have much to discuss. Okay. Man, this has been a stream. Fuck. Achievement unlocked. You say what? You say you want a revolution. Hmm. Uh, we also now have a class quest. I think I've already done it on my Dark Knight. Um, is there anything I need to do? Well, we'll talk. But if we start moving to a new area, then unfortunately, that is where I will have to call it. It's gloomy outside, but the dogs do need a walk. And I have the midday shift, unfortunately. So let's see what she wants. The Solail was eastward bound, so I sent word to Clem Cloudtop on the off chance the air surpassing nearby. Sure enough, uh, Lady Leante informed me that it has been sighted by her scouts. Then the Archbishop is somewhere in the Sea of Clouds, or was not long ago. The airship has not been seen since it disappeared into the northern reaches near the Blue Window. Alas. Because of the regions fir uh, firmly held by the Vanu Vanu and not easily accessible from, cloud uh, from Camp Cloudtop, House Haleanarte has yet to establish a foothold. We will need not only an airship but a captain bold enough to risk the beastman's wrath. I think we both know a perfect candidate. Let us pray visit to Master Garland in the Sky Steel Manufactory. I see. Then I will take my leave for now. Are there other, um, there are other matters which require my attention. Alright, onward to sit then. Uh, we also have the blue quest. Uh, honoring the past. Uh, which we need to do in that particular region. So, yeah. I think... Will it open it up right now? Not yet. I think it's this one. It's kind of weird that it is actually that one. Other way. It's over there. Ah, the Dastali duo, what mischief have you two been getting into lately? 
You haven't heard, haven't you? I hardly know where to start. He was a good man. Did you know him? Sid, have you ever heard of Alice La? The Archbishop spoke of it before he fled. No, but probably some source of phenomenal cosmic power that's key to his plans. From what he told Daly, the Asians tried to tempt him as they tempted Gaius with the ultimate weapon. Even if he spoke true about playing along, I can see him attempting to seize it. If we need another reason to pursue him, as we need another reason to pursue Well, I'm convinced the Enterprise is at your disposal. Come to the airship landing when you're ready to depart. Uh, we will do that. We will do that. Ah. It's just as well. After pulling you out of the fire the last few times, I reckon I was due to deliver you into it. Well, that makes sense. Go into the blue. Into the fire as it is. In the case, I should... Uh, in that case, I should inform that of our plans. Go on ahead to the Asher planning, I'll show you and I will join you and none. <laughs> Oof. Oh man, that hurt. So we are actually going to a new area then. That is, oh, that's the Sage mission. Uh, I'll do that off, off cam. Uh, most likely during, I don't know, some sort of a shift. Probably on a Friday. The boys have been hard at work preparing for your flight and I'm pleased to say we are ready to depart. Yeah, let's go. Uh, that is as soon as a certain... Ah, there you go. Let's go. Ray, forgive me my lateness. Dr. Ray and I had much to discuss. We still have no news for the, for the missing science, but she assured me that Oranger and Ryle are pursuing promised leads. Come, come. We can continue this discussion aboard the Enterprise. Such an epic thing to just go to a new map, okay? This, we didn't do that previously. Sure, let's go. Uh, the other's waiting for a boat the Empire, so we gotta go, and yes, let's go. The Sea of Clouds. And we the arrive reaches of the sea of clouds, when it's dark. Where countless isles yet remained uncharted. In search of a mysterious land known as Azizla and the unmasked villain who sought to claim its secrets. <clears throat> Oblivious to the new threat which followed in their wake, they came. Okay. Um. Oh, that's nice. We don't have... Oh, there is a crystal over there. 
dungeon over there. From here, Clan Cloudtops look rather far. <clears throat> be on your guard. The Vanu could be anywhere, even watching us as we speak. So I don't think this is going to be a very long map. We have some ether currents. We also have a mission over here that will give us one. <coughs> Assuming the Solail is here, I doubt she will come to us. We should begin searching the island in earnest. Of course, we must remain vigilant for the Vanu scouts as well. I would rather avoid unnecessary bloodshed. Needless bloodshed, actually. <coughs> Uh, let's get the uh, the current. Let's also get our choker bow. Yeah, no flying for us today, mate. We're skipping a map. Interesting. Wait, I need to be over here. Oh, yeah. Look out. Wait, did I not type that correctly? Yeah, no, it doesn't have three O's. There's a city. Mayhap this effort was doomed to failure. Bag's mercy of Netherling does not fight, does not wish to die. Was that a Varu being attacked? But by whom? Over there. Imperial troops. As guardians, seize them. They'll know where the Archbishop is. Why, why do you need the Archbishop, dude? The enemy of my enemy. We have no choice. Let's protect the Vanu. First the, um, actually the Medicus needs to die, but, you know, we'll get to that. Thaliac, protect me. Yeah, you protect something, mate, that's fine. Some Centurion, some other dudes. Blind it. But it doesn't seem the others are getting much damage, so yeah. Oh, there's a medic. There you go. He's, he's, he's one of those little... Little things.
Let's uh, make sure this guy dies as well. Come on. Group them up. That was easy. Uh, Needlings save Lonivaru from certain death. Show showers Needlings with fangs like summer quail. Lonivaru knows not what winds bears Needlings to cloud sea, but warmly welcomes them. Shows gratitude where gratitude is due. Alright. Um, Vonu Vanu owes much and more to needlings. As saviors, as heroes, Zandu welcomes you. The village we go to north. Come, come. Okay, so there's one over there, but Elfinot feels the need to talk to me. So the Guardians were searching for the Archbishop and believe that the Vanu Vanu knew something of its whereabouts. Methods now withstanding, they may have had the right of it. I concern that we should accept Vanu Vanu's offer of hospitality and visit his visit, a village. Yeah, I was having the same idea, mate. Yeah, I don't think this is a long map for, for whatever reason. Like, we also have Idle Shire. We need to go and... Like, we've already seen ha almost well, half of the map. Yeah, well, no, not quite. And we've already have two Ethers. And we have a quest for the third. And I'm just going to assume there's maybe one in the village as well. 266 northeast. Two hundred and sixty-six is not that much. One thirty one forty-three. I'm actually going to skip him. Sorry, I'm just going to go for the Etherite. And, and that's where we end it. Uh, I'm tired and, and, and I, I just... I have a headache. I hate emotional stuff. Anyways, thank you so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. If you haven't already, give me a follow. Appreciate that. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.